Every day across the country, the National Fish and Wildlife Foundation supports hundreds of actions to protect and restore our native species. Here in California, our partnerships in Mount Shasta, the Walker Basin, and the Russian River are tackling tough conservation issues, and the results are impressive. Man-made changes to the landscape have degraded the cold water springs and streams that flow from Mount Shasta. NIFWIF is working with partners to restore the streams, and salmon and steelhead are returning once again to their ancient habitat. One of the things that's really special about this place is that it's a spring-fed creek that's still available to salmon. When I'm snorkeling under here and I see fish in habitats that weren't there before, it really makes me feel like we're changing this place and for the better. To see fish in this short period of time that have traveled so far, if that doesn't hit you at a spiritual level, then there's not much else that will. So it's pretty exciting. Coho salmon had almost disappeared from the Russian River because the water levels were dropping and fish couldn't swim upstream to spawn. NIFWIF is working with vineyard owners to limit their water withdrawals and helping fisheries managers bring in young coho to increase the population. I'm very proud of being both a, a vineyard owner um, and a fisherman to see the native fish come back to the Russian River Valley. And to be a part of that is really special. You know, I love this project. This is a classic example of the things that NIFWIF can do so well. We've got business interests, community organizations, and environmental organizations all working together to save coho salmon. Over the last century, the elevation of Walker Lake has dropped more than 150 feet, threatening this unique ecosystem. Farmers in the valley need the water to irrigate their lands, but wildlife need water to survive. Through voluntary agreements with landowners, NIFWIF is reversing the trend and putting water back in Walker Lake. NIFWIF is well suited for a project like Walker Lake where there's so many interests because in fact it brings a lot of resources to the table, which this wouldn't happen without those resources. The agencies like NIFWIF being involved and in the focus that they have on the entire Walker Basin, you know, hopefully be able to turn this back into what it really should be. To see it restored would be uh, a dream come true. I think there's a new conservation model that's developing and a more habitat approach. And I think NIFWIF is uniquely qualified of the groups that I know to, to lead that effort. What NIFWIF has been able to do in the last several years is make incredible strides in finding science-based solutions to problems. Although NIFWIF works in all 50 states, uh, I particularly appreciate the work it does in the places that touch me. Here in California and across the country, the National Fish and Wildlife Foundation is working to protect and restore the natural places that are so precious to all of us. The foundation has put more than $2 billion in conservation investments on the ground in the last 26 years, and we've made the most of every dollar. We're proud of that record, but we know there's much more to be done. With your participation, we can make our shared vision a reality. We're grateful to you for joining us, and with your help, we'll continue to shape the future of American conservation.